Are you interested in reducing water changes, replacing existing technologies like algae scrubbers to reduce nitrates in your aquariums? Follow me on a new emerging technology and my initial experiments and uh, results. Hello, Facebook and YouTube followers. This is uh, Half Man, Half Cichlid. Uh, in my quest for nitrate reduction, and some of you followed me on YouTube and, and Facebook, I, I experiment with different methods. Uh, so far, the most successful method seems to be the hydroponic grow bed, but uh, it's not possible for everyone because it requires space and plumbing and uh, some other things that may be a little too uh, involved. But, but anyway, then, uh, you know, then I graduated to algae scrubbers, which I've uh, basically uh, taken down because of uh, uh, minimal impact on nitrates. D they were DIY nitrate scrubbers. And they got pretty messy as far as cleaning them up. They were pretty successful, uh, I might I might say, in growing algae, but not in reducing nitrates. So this may be because I've been trying them on big aquariums, 200, 340 uh, uh, gallon tanks. But anyway, my latest experiment is what I'm calling a uh, a nitrate reducer with uh, water lettuce. That's what we have here. I have a large hang on back DIY uh, uh, filter and uh, suspended above it. I have a special light for uh, growing aquaponics. And you can see the overflow tubes from the uh, aquarium into the hang on back, which supplies the water. Then on top of the hang on back, I've got uh, a police piece of that typical material folks are using to cover their aquarium, very cheap from Home Depot. And then uh, the magic is in what's growing on the inside and under the light. And uh, in my case, I am using uh, dwarf water lettuce. Now this stuff has really long roots. It's noted in aquaponic water purification circles as one of the top water purifiers. Uh, I have to harvest the water lettuce, lettuce out of this uh, set up probably every, about every five days. And uh, so I know I'm producing a lot of biomass and for that biomass to grow uh, it must be consuming a lot of uh, fish uh, waste products. So anyway, uh, right now I'm quite happy with the way this is going. I'm still measuring the nitrate impact too early uh, to comment, but from a maintenance standpoint, uh, it's easy to just pluck, pluck out six or eight of these uh, plants every five days and uh, I put them in my pond in the backyard, or I use them in uh, other uh, setups where I'm testing the water lettuce right now as a water purification mechanism. I don't think there's any doubt that this plant, based on published studies, is uh, probably the, one of the best options. It's just now working out the kinks in adapting that to an aquarium uh, purification system. Thank you.